this is the second part of this video. So in case you haven't watched the first part, just go back and watch the episode 2.1 and then come back to this video. With the first stage, you got the answer that why do you want to take a drop? And that's because you are not getting the colleges that you wanted to get. Now in this stage, you need to ask yourself another question. And that is, what are the reasons of this? What are the reasons of your low rank? Or in other words, we can say what are the reasons of your failure? Now this can have a number of excuses or maybe reasons also. So now you have to judge are these the reasons or the excuses. So I'll be listing a number of reasons for you and you have to figure out if it is an excuse or a reason. So the first reason is coping up with school and the coaching institute. Or in other words you can say coping up with JWE and coping up with boards. So, that's a valid reason actually because throughout the year we are confused whether to study for JWE or to study for boards. Even I was confused. So in that case that's a valid reason. But to all the people who haven't joined the regular schooling it's not a valid reason. Because some of you would be there or I should say most of you would not have joined the regular schooling. You would have focused completely on the coaching institute and JWE. So in that case, that's not a valid reason and that would be rather counted as an excuse. So to all the people who have joined regular schooling and they are having this reason, then your reason is valid. You can move on to other reasons and then you can move on to the stage 3. Otherwise, if you are a student who haven't joined the regular schooling and you are having this reason, then that's an excuse. The second reason and the most liked reason is smartphone addiction. Now, most of you would be having this reason. But to be honest, don't consider this as the main reason while considering to take a drop. Because if you know that you it was wasting your time, then you would have left it. And since you couldn't leave it, that means your addiction is to a different level. So in that case, you can consider this as a side reason. And even if you are considering this as a side reason, then don't dare to use your smartphone in your drop year. ऐसा मत सोचना कि तुम प्रूव करके दिखाओगे कि नहीं भाई स्मार्टफोन के साथ भी हम लोग ड्रॉप ईयर कर सकते हैं ऐसा बहुत कम लोगों के साथ होता है मेरे साथ भी नहीं हुआ था मैंने भी कोशिश करी थी ड्रॉप ईयर से पहले सो आई वाज यूजिंग द स्मॉल लिटल टाइनी फोन ड्यूरिंग माय ड्रॉप ईयर जर्नी सो डोंट कंसिडर दिस एज अ मेन रीज़न दिस कैन बी कंसिडर एज अ साइड रीज़न नाउ द थर्ड रीज़न इज़ द मोस्ट वैलिड रीज़न अकॉर्डिंग टू मी एंड दैट्स द वेल बींग well-being of a student or their family members so quite a few people would be having this reason but to whosoever is having this reason this is a valid reason now what has happened in this case is in the last few days of your examinations you fell ill and due to which your performance has declined slightly that has affected your ranks so mostly the people who were there in the stage 2 3 stage 1 category number 2 3 and 4 would be having this reason but in this reason be truthful first don't consider your excuse as a reason and second you should have that much of confidence in yourself that if you are not ill then you could have performed really well in the examination if you are sure about this then this is a valid reason otherwise not the fourth reason is faculty and books So some people would be having this reason that it was just because of their inexperienced faculty that they were not able to qualify the examination. That's just a perspective, because one person might like a particular teacher, and the other person may not. The same teacher. So in that case, you cannot consider this as the sole reason for taking a drop. Then some people would be there who would say that they were not having a good knowledge of which books they should refer to. while preparing for the examination now that's a valid reason but again that cannot be considered as the main reason for taking a drop you can take this as a side reason and keep this thing in mind that while in the drop year you should be very particular in choosing which books and material you should refer to and stick to them rather than jumping from one book to another and one material to another the fifth reason is revision and not enough time for the preparation this reason can be considered as the sub part of the reason one where we talked about coping up with school and the coaching institute well no time is enough for any preparation 
especially in the case of JWE. You won't be satisfied at any point of your time during your preparation, not even on the last day when you have to give the examination. So yeah, this can be taken as a good reason because with the drop year there comes a lot of time where you have enough time for the preparation also and the revision also. The last reason is friends. The most common and a very good reason for taking a drop. So to all the people who say that they were not able to focus on their studies and their preparation because of the distractions they face from their friends and in that case their girlfriends also and now you want to get a chance to prove yourself and prove them also that you were eligible to take admission in IITs then fine go for it but keep in mind this thing that this time you should not let the same friends and in that case any of the friends hinder your preparation during this drop year now we move on to the last stage and this stage is the most important one if i have to give weightage to all the three stages then i would give 20 percent to the stage one 30 percent to the stage two and 50 percent to the stage three so that's how you can imagine how important this stage is in this stage i'll tell you a number of problems that you will have to face throughout this journey now if you are ready to handle all these problems and you are sure about that then you are ready to go and otherwise not but be truthful and practical in this stage. Think a lot many times before you decide whether you can handle these problems or not. The first thing is self-motivation. And that's the most crucial thing you will need throughout the year. And I repeat it, that's self-motivation and not just motivation. And if you think that you can get it while watching YouTube videos and reading the cheesy answers on Quora, then you are definitely wrong. Because that's, that motivation is just temporary. You will watch one video, then other and then the other. As a result, you will end up wasting your time and then regretting that you haven't done anything. You will surely get the motivation from those videos. But believe me, at one point, you will be done with all such videos and then you will need the motivation that's buried inside you. So if you think that you can motivate yourself without watching the videos, and give yourself an impulse every time you feel lack of confidence then go for a drop otherwise don't dare to because you cannot survive on external motivation you need your own the next difficulty is steady momentum and that can be considered as a sub part of self motivation because if you are self motivated it will result in a steady momentum but on the other hand if you become overconfident then you can lose your momentum so you need to have a balance between both you need to have a balance between confidence, overconfidence and lack of confidence. In the same way, you need to have a balance between self-motivation and lack of motivation. So whenever you complete a chapter, whenever you complete a topic, whenever you complete even the, even the syllabus, so don't be happy, don't celebrate your victory there. You need to celebrate only when you get the results. The next reason is criticism. If you don't have to do this अगर तुम्हें यही सोचना है तो मत करो ड्रॉप बिकॉज़ यू शुड नेवर फॉरगेट थ्रू आउट द जर्नी दैट यू ड्रॉप द ईयर फॉर योरसेल्फ टू फुलफिल योर ड्रीम्स शुड नॉट वरी अबाउट द पीपल हु क्रिटिसाइज यू मुझे एक बार ड्रॉप के स्टार्टिंग में मेरे अंकल ने कहा था कि गलती करिए ड्रॉप करके मेरे फ्रेंड के बेटे ने भी करा था उसकी तो इस बार और भी कम रैंक आई है आई डिडंट से हिम एनीथिंग आई न्यू द फैक्ट दैट 40 टू 60% ऑफ द पीपल हु टेक अ ड्रॉप for selected in IITs are the droppers. But I didn't say him anything because I wanted to prove him by showing the result and not to say something. So if you are ready to bear the criticism and to ignore them, then take a drop. Otherwise don't. Don't think that if this time it didn't happen, what will people say? So the last difficulty is friends and their college life. So that's not that much of a big difficulty that you have to face but at certain point of this journey, you will definitely face this. When you will see your friends enjoying their fun college life, their new college life, and then you will feel sad or you might even regret taking a drop. So you have to cross this hurdle too. At such times, always tell yourself that it's just one year that you have to complete and then you will definitely have a better and a fun college life as they do. So that's all for this video and I'll see you in the next one.